Well, I look at this program as a sport and exercise sciences course, but with a big difference. Rather uniquely, King's College London has real expertise in the sport and exercise sciences, but is also world renowned for its work in the medical sciences too. And this course aims to combine the two, where you can learn about all the biological and psychological factors underlying normal human function, and indeed elite performance too, but also about pathological mechanisms and how they can be prevented and treated through exercise and lifestyle interventions. Of course, one of the reasons this type of course is possible at an institution like King's is because of our university's integration and collaboration with three local NHS foundation trusts. And indeed, there's great need for this type of course. Not only is there ever-growing funding and reliance on sports scientists in the professional sports sectors, but also the increasing incidences of obesity, metabolic diseases, and indeed the aging population are providing huge challenges to society and people with expertise within the exercise sciences are going to be in ever increasing demand. Well, I studied sports science myself a few years ago now, and it was the only subject I had a real passion for. Personally, I've always been interested in sports and how different and specific types of exercise training can improve elite performance and lead to sporting success. Um, but since my degree, my main interest, like many others here at King's, has been trying to apply those principles to disease, to injury and to ageing. Essentially looking at how changing lifestyles and exercise habits can help patients, whether that be by improving function and mobility, reducing distressing symptoms like breathlessness, and of course increasing lifespan and the quality of that life. And unlike most sports science courses, this programme offers students the opportunity to study both both the performance and clinical aspects of the area. And so they'll receive teaching from research scientists like myself and also clinicians in a variety of formats, lectures, laboratory practicals, getting stuck in, in the anatomy dissection rooms, and also potentially doing projects in one of our great many research labs or indeed in the clinical environments of one of our hospital partners. Well, first and foremost, on this course, we'll be training students to become scientists and scientists who can specialise in a wide range of disciplines. One of the things that first drew me to the subject as an undergrad was the massive choice in learning opportunities that this type of degree can offer. And as I've just said, King's has the ability to offer an even wider range of opportunities that most institutions can't match. So I know that many students doing this degree will be interested in studying human performance and perhaps will want to work as a sports scientist, whether that be in the academic world, in sports teams or indeed both. And we offer a whole range of modules and practical training focusing on the physiological, psychological, biomechanical and nutritional factors in elite performance. But there's also an ever increasing need for exercise specialists within the NHS and the public health settings and we'll offer students the tools and the opportunities to forge career paths in this extremely vital developing area.